once the litter's born, we care for that litter till eight weeks of age at the complex. And then from eight weeks onwards, they're fostered out to mainly police officers who have a desire to be dog handlers. And then they come back three days a month minimum to do what we call nose, nose work imprinting and bite work imprinting. Now, on big fella. For the first six months of their life, we make it games for them. We make it like the track, the nose work little puzzles that they have to work out to fill their belly with food. Oh, you want more? Yes, you want more, don't you? So in tracking, we're looking for um, a really high food drive, a dog's desire to come out, find the food on the ground and associate that with scent. And once he's learnt that scent equals reward, scent equals food, and we just make the tracks longer, we put changes of direction into them and then it becomes a, a kind of a puzzle for the dog to work out. We start our bite work at around 10 weeks of age. We use what we call our prey drive, so the, the drive, the instinctive drive that they have to chase and bite like they would if they were trying to ch chase and bite a rabbit, we call that prey drive and that's the drive we use to get them to chase rags, bite rags and then we teach tug of war and we teach good grip so they don't get to win and possess the rag or the toy until they've got a really strong grip and a really nice tug of war. So they have a lot of energy, a lot of um, boisterousness and also a lot of tenacity to succeed and, and get what, what they want skills that they're going to need later on as police dogs. Yeah.